Yo, 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 and a ho, 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 and welcome back to another festive edition of Rob's Homemade. We are killing this Christmas calendar and these festive um, videos this year. I'm uploading twice a day, a lot of the time. Got the Christmas calendar, we've got 24 days of hot sauce, we've got the chocolate, we've got everything going on, but today, we are here, we are here, we are here, for Greg's Two Fabulously Festive Limited Edition Bakes. These are exclusive to Iceland. I popped into Iceland the other day because I had nothing else to do. So I thought I'd pop in and see what they've got. The Limited Edition Delicious Chicken Breast Pieces. Should have been turkey, really, I suppose. Sage and onion stuffing, sweet cured bacon in a creamy sage and cranberry sauce, parcel, parceled up in our crumb topped, tasty puff pastry. They smell really nice. I've baked off one of the two. Um, John, I'm really sorry, but the way things are at the moment, you can't tie this. But I'm going to cook off the other one and I'm going to give it to you. I will bring that to you. And you can try the Greg's Fabulously Festive Bakes, exclusive to Iceland. And do you know what? What's, this is really worrying me. Right. The whole side of this packet has the ingredients. I hope you can see that. If I was to sit and read those ingredients, this would turn into a 20-minute video. Because there's got to be about well let's just do, i'll tell you what i'm going to go through the first row we have water fortified wheat calcium carbonate iron nasses palm oil cooked diced chicken breast 10 percent chicken breast salt desco sage and onion stuffing balls five percent water rusk wheat dried herbs dried onions and salt so that's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve so 12, 24. There's got to be at least 60 odd ingredients in that. Into a festive pasta. How can you fit that much in there? Greg's in Iceland, I don't know. But I'm going to cut this bad boy. I'm going to be posh today. I've got a knife and fork. Knife and fork. I'm going to cut this in half. It is crispy puff pastry and it's cooked really well. Right, that's enough of the knife and fork. I'm not that posh. So there we have it. Nice steamy. I'm gonna have to take the glasses off. Who can we give the glasses to? Santa! Yeah, we can have the Santa glasses. Oh well. So this is the Fabulously Festive Baked Limited Edition from Greg's, exclusive to Iceland. So here goes. Cheers, guys. Do you know what? It's not bad. The overwhelming taste and the overwhelming flavour is the sage and onion stuffing. Because there's tons of it in here. Absolutely tons of it. I can see a little red speck. which might be a bit of cranberry. Well, I'm hoping it's a bit of cranberry. To be perfectly honest, the only taste you get out of this is the sage and onion stuffing. Paste is crispy, it's crunchy, it's nice. 
I just wish you had more flavours. You can see, I'm going to open this up. <clears throat> so you can see how much stuffing's in there. That's a big stuffing ball. There's a nice piece of smoked bacon in there, but you're not getting the smoked bacon or the chicken flavour. But it's okay for a pasta, for a quick snack. It's not that bad at all. Mm. It's definitely edible. Definitely, definitely edible. But delicious chicken breast pieces, sage and onion stuffing, sweet cure bacon, creamy sage and cranberry sauce. I think that's the problem. You got the sage and onion stuffing and you got the sage and cranberry sauce. You should have just done a cranberry sauce in there, not with sage as well, because the sage flavour is so overpowering. That's all you get. I'm gonna give these, I'm gonna give it a five. It's about average for a pasta. But like I've said, there's literally 70 ingredients in this. And I'm really, really, I mean, there's a couple here. Concentrate red currant juice. Don't get no red currant. Smoke flavoring honey. Um, let's see. Rape seed oil, sweet and dried cranberries, one percent. Cranberry sugar, sunflower oil. You don't taste. There's no cranberry taste in there at all. It's just basically the um, sage and stuff in. But I'm all right. I'll give them a five. I'll give them an average five because it's a festive thing. Sage and onion stuff in is. A massive, massive part of everyone's Christmas dinner, and it's a lovely flavour, but there's too much in there. There's too way too much. The colours maybe put a bit of sausage in there, maybe made a pig in blanket on the inside. I don't know. I don't work for these companies. I don't, they've obviously tested, tried and tested their ingredients and thought it was good. But quick snack. I can't, I honestly can't remember how much I paid for these because I bought multiple things while I was in Iceland and I didn't check. So that was my review of two fabu fabulously festive bakes, limited edition. I'm obviously limited because they're only going to be around over Christmas. Exclusive, exclusively to Iceland from Greg's. I was going to go into Greg's and get me a festive bake, but when I went into Iceland and saw the, I thought I might as well buy these and cook them myself probably cost me less to be fair but anyway thank you very much for watching from fat elf on the shelf or on the box katie carrot rudolph santa and the rest of the crew that keeps coming back and supporting these videos as you guys do i love reading your comments and as you know i reply to every single person that's something that i've always wanted since i started this youtube channel I've always wanted to interact and speak to people. I don't want to be one of those YouTubers who just ignores people, com people's comments. Sometimes it might take me a while to reply, but I will always, at the moment, reply to every single comment that's in the comment section because I feel it's only fair that you take your time to sit and watch and hopefully enjoy my videos. So I mean, I should be replying and saying thank you for watching, blah, blah, blah. But it means a lot for you guys to comment and say, I'm enjoying these videos, I love these videos. It's getting very festive on here. And it's getting very hot in this kitchen, to be fair. But, but just want to say, from two fabulously festive bakes, Greg's exclusively to Iceland, thank you very much for watching. Rating number five. Smash that like button. <coughs> Hit that subscribe button. And I'll be back 
very, very soon. Peace!